beautiful, isn't it? Peace. Such peace. This makes up for me not being able to get out of Holford much. Coming here to Dolbury Warren and Robert Warren. This is uh, a big compensation in its own right though, don't forget, in its own right. I'd often wondered if, um, I think my sister Jude said she'd never been here. I find that hard to believe that she'd never explored this lovely area. Look at that old trailer, storing nutrients, allowed to rot naturally, like it should be able to, not be chopped up and firewood, like they're clearing on parts of our hill fort. Yeah, I do love this place. I, I, it, I feel like I was only here last week. It's, it's a really strange thing because I know it so well. I am wondering whether to go a different route, even. Um, no, go the route you planned. Go the route you planned. Oh, look at that there. Look at that lovely view. Look at those lovely trees, everyone. People coming. There's always somebody coming when I start videoing. Look at that tree there, that one. Looks ancient, doesn't it? Noisy people coming. Breaking the peace. Turning off for a minute, back on again. Little family just going by, enjoying the air. Yeah, lovely tall trees here. Like I was just saying, this this is this stands in its own right for me, although it's new compared to the ancient woods of the Condock Hills. That is a special place to me, anyway. Very special. This is a later in life place where I found a lot of peace in my, my turbulent older life. Um, which we're coping with. This lovely carved fir tree. Look at it. I've taken pictures of it loads of times probably. Look at it. Amazing, amazing. They do thin these out every now and again. And they fall naturally. Yeah, there used to be horses, I think there probably still is, but somebody bought the cottage up the top there, the pink cottage. And uh, they're getting it together slowly. I suspect during the Covid period and over winter, looks like they've done a lot of tidying this area. Stacking logs. Um, when I get past the cottage, this morning, I won't be going up by the big stream. I'm turning up into the wood. Um, normally I follow the stream up and then climb up a different route. We're not doing that today. Place of peace. This this hill fort is so 
special and peaceful. It really is. And just to think 3,000 years ago, the people that were moving about here wouldn't look nothing like this, so don't forget. There's a little stream there, that side. It has been known to go down here, but they've done a lot of chopping here, look. And there's the hill fort. I've, I've sat and climbed all the way up that bit. There's a way, there's a way of getting up there through these steps. This is um, remains of old miners' residences here. Right, back on again. I just walked through. There's a young man doing things in the garden, but I asked him if it was right to walk through still. He, he, he said, yeah. He said, pe people do try to avoid the house. And he wasn't very engaging, so it could be that he doesn't want the herds. What with all the COVID and the herds of people. So I, I moved quietly on. That's the sort of ladder I need, that height for my attic. Somebody else coming now. There's always somebody comes when I'm going to do my videoing. Right, let's try the video again. I've done a couple of short ones, I've got to remember to link them up. Because every time I've started the video, someone's come. There's up an old track here. I just met the little, little chap doing this, the pink cottage up. Which I think I mentioned it on the last little bit I did. He obviously would get fed up having to talk to every single person who walked by. So, I think he doesn't really want people. I think it's a right of way, though. I mean, I've never seen anyone. Um, I got a feeling I passed there once when a bloke collapsed. An old chap. The dog wouldn't stop barking. I think something happened. That was several years ago. <clears throat> then it fell into a bit of disrepair. Now if you go down there, which I think I've done, You join up with the main route going along, skirting the fort. That's one way if you want to do a little circular for a uh, route there. The fort is, of course, over there. Now I'm going this way through the through the Warren. You can see a silver vehicle over there. Probably Woodman. Primroses out. Quite a lot of primroses. One of my mum's favourite plants of primrose and roses and peonies. We used to have these lovely peonies in our front garden that everyone admired. Don't see many of them. I've got a feeling I might have had them once. Some in one of my gardens. Not quite sure. It's beautiful though, aren't they? I 
I haven't looked at my watch and I'm not going to. I'm not going to look at it till I get to Tinian's farm later on. I don't want to be judged, I don't want to be a dictator to by time. Because I know I've got time. I don't want it to interfere with this part of the walk. There's a few people up there working on the logs. Up there. Looks quite clear in areas there. Turning off again. <laughs>